those who find themselves, uh, you wake up one morning or in the middle of the night, yes. your, your house is flooding. Yes. It's either flooded or flooding. Yeah. The risks there. Now let's look at the risks. Okay. Risk one, uh, the doors could be jammed because of the water flow. Um, so uh, what you need to ensure is, can you be able to get out? How do you get out? Open the door, the one that you can. Try and stay on higher ground on, in your house. Do you step on the table? If the water now starts flowing too much, you can feel the water, you need to get out of that house. Yeah? But before that, I always say you've got to be prepared. Uh, I know um, emergency readiness is something that sometimes we never yes. look at. Yeah? We never even, um, you never imagine that you could actually even have a, a life vest. Actually, uh, on a very light note, and I know uh, this doesn't... Uh, during the 2019 census, yes. there was a question yes. uh, in, in the census survey that asked us as Kenyans, do you own a boat? Yes. And I know I'm saying this, it's not the right thing to say at this point, but there was that question. But yes. we never look at, you know, emergency readiness or other re re readiness on an individual capacity. Yes. So what do I need? Um, first thing first, you've got to ensure you have key um, first aid kit. Very important. Um, what else do you have? A torch. Make sure you have enough water supply in your house. Make sure that you have a packed bag whereby you'll have change of clothing, dry clothing. If you're two, three in the family, ensure that you have enough package for them. Um, at the um, clothing, um, you also have like uh, gumboots for wading on water. You've got to make sure that you have a raincoat, something to make sure you keep dry. And then um, I always call it an emergency pack. Yeah? Uh, torches is very key because you will need to see where you're going. So if you can have this emergency pack in your in your home, safety pack, we call it a flight kit. Mm -hmm. That would flight be very yeah. That would be very very important for you. Mm -hmm. Yes. But I think a majority of us will be thinking, where is my ID? Where are my certificates? Where are my cell phones and no, such? No, that also goes into your in into the kit. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Make sure that whatever documents that need to, you always have in any emergency. You need to know where your documents are. Mm -hmm. So. If you can be able to have this prepared in early in time, I know these are some of the things that we teach yes. um, in St. John's. What is it that is key? You ensuring that you have your emergency, your emergency tools with you. Mm -hmm. Emergency tools, this is some of them. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because I know documentation is very key. It's very key. Yeah.